Buongiorno. It's a beautiful early day here in Italia and it's time to come home. So here we are down here once again, one last time for breakfast and then it'll be off to the airport. Standard fare for breakfast. Got myself a little meat and fruit plate going on, some scrambled eggs and those little hot dog pieces. I got my two drinks again, my grapefruit juice and my mixed fruit juice. We are at Fiumicino Airport, waiting in line to check in for our flight from here in Rome to Philadelphia, which will be our first stop and only stop before we finally reach back home to Atlanta, Hartsfield, Latoya Jackson Spaceport and Hot Wing Emporium. Um, only those of y'all from the ATL will know what I'm talking about when I say that, but uh, right now it is 8.32 local time here in Rome that is 2 30 a.m. back at home and we are scheduled to arrive tonight in Atlanta at like 9 5 p.m. so still a long day of travel ahead of us we just said goodbye to Elena our tour director who is fantastic we are definitely gonna miss her and we also had to say our goodbyes to all of the Colorado crew so to all of you Scott Janelle, Tori, Piper, Ava, Brema, Serena, Lane, and Landon. Hope I'm not forgetting anybody. I think that's everybody. They challenged me to know who all of them were, but forgot to call me on that challenge. But I know, and I remember. Thank you all for such a wonderful trip and fitting in so wonderfully with our group and for making long-lasting memories for all of us. We truly are going to miss you, and we hope to keep up with you guys through social media and things like that going forward. So safe travels to y'all. Obviously, by the time that this video gets posted, hopefully all of us will be home. Hey, everybody. We're getting ready to board. That's our plane right there in the background. Getting ready to head to Philadelphia here from Fumacimo. So it'll be about a 10-hour flight. We'll see what we look like when we get off the plane in Philly. All right, we're getting ready to board the plane. Having to take an escalator down to the ramp here at our gate to walk on board. Let's see what this all looks like. All right, every airport's a little different. Here we go. There's our plane that you can see out there. So again, getting on board going to be estimated 10 hour flight to get us to Philadelphia. We have a few hours in Philadelphia and then on to home. So I'll pick up with you guys when we're in the city of brotherly love. Back in the USA hey, baby. <laughs> now just a three and a half hour wait to oh. our flight home to Atlanta. All right, we are in Philly, and so since we knew we were going to be in Philly for this layover, many of us knew we had to get cheesesteaks if we're going to be in Philadelphia. So luckily, Gino Steaks has a stand here. Johnson got himself a mushroom cheesesteak. I got a regular cheesesteak, and I got some cheese fries, and then Jacob and Aiden both got some cheesesteaks as well, and then everybody else is hitting up the Lord's Chicken over there at Chick-fil-A. Hey guys, Future Zach here. What you're about to see are uh, just some of the kids that went on the trip with us while we were waiting um, for our layover in Philadelphia uh, before our flight home, which was a very long layover. I gave them the opportunity uh, to talk and share their favorite things about the trip. Um, this isn't everyone uh, that went with us, but uh, just those that wanted to appear on camera and give their thoughts, experiences, etc. cetera. Um, I did give the opportunity, I reached out to the Colorado crew um, to let me know what their favorite things were as well. Um, but as of right now, I haven't heard anything back from anyone in Colorado yet. If they do send me um, their favorite stuff uh, going forward, I'll probably make a separate video just to show that to you guys as well. So here you go. Enjoy some of what uh, the kids found the most enjoyable about the trip. Hey, I'm Aiden, and my favorite part about this trip was going to see the Coliseum. My favorite thing that I had to eat was 
probably the simpler foods like the pizza and pasta and stuff like that. And besides the Coliseum, probably just hanging out with everybody, getting to know new people, make new memories with old friends and new friends. Hi, I'm Christy, and my favorite part of the trip was, of course, Italy and visiting Assisi, but I really enjoyed sitting on the bus and watching the countryside change as we traveled through the countries. Hi, I'm Jalen. My favorite part about this trip was visiting Cannes, France, and walking along the French Riviera along the beach in the very clear, beautiful water. Uh, my name is Teresa and I like gelato. Oh. Hi, my name is Grayson and my favorite things about Europe were probably the food like pizza, pasta, gelato, all of it was amazing and definitely the views. The views were very beautiful. So favorite part about this trip was probably going to the museum and seeing David in person and seeing the, how big that statue was and then all of the other collections of art from the artist and uh, people from the Renaissance era. Uh, that were in Florence and that's why they were like all in that one exhibit. Here we go, finally boarding the last flight home. Next stop, Atlanta. Welcome home, you've arrived. This has been the longest travel day of all time. The short little connecting flight. We had to wait 45 minutes in the plane before we ever even took off. And then when we got here, we had to wait 30 more minutes on the plane because they couldn't get anybody to come and uh, get the stairs to move the tunnel over for us to get off. So uh, it's very, very enjoyable. We are exhausted. So it has been a couple days uh, as of this video right now since we arrived home. Um, don't know if I look it or not, but I am still very jet lagged. That first night back, I think I only got four or five hours of sleep um, at the most because my body just was not adjusted yet. Um, so I was extremely tired uh, last night and went to bed early again. And I did get about 10 hours of sleep last night. Um, I'm still feeling it very, very much today. So thankful that we don't have a super busy schedule uh, this weekend. Um, tomorrow is Ty's birthday, so I'm sure we'll be doing some special things for him, but we luckily planned his party for the following weekend uh, so that we wouldn't be rushed around and having to put something together just as I came home. So hope you guys enjoyed going along with us on this incredible trip to mainland Europe. Um, now it's time for a little R&R <laughs> here at home. Uh, for the next few days and getting back adjusted to the summer schedule. So uh, if you like the content, again, make sure you like, leave me a comment, um, and subscribe because there's so much that we're going to be bringing to you guys um, on this channel going forward. But once again, thank you so much for coming along with us on this ride. What's your why?